Hey everybody, Scott Sprinter here, DocSports.com. Hope you all had a great weekend. We've got a free pick in NBA playoff action coming up in just a moment. We look to win again in the NBA with the free picks. Before I get to that, a quick note. Uh, if you've yet to become a member over at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run. It's a real cool way to do so. You click on the link below the video and you get set up for a free $60 account, which you can use on any of my daily packages or any other capper over at DocSports.com. Again, all you got to do is click on the link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account. And uh, not a bad day to do it because on Monday, I've got a six-unit side in the NBA playoffs. And uh, that's my highest rated play so far this postseason in the NBA. I've also got an NHL play, five-unit play, first period play. If you can get down on first periods, uh, one of the games on Monday in the NHL happens to be a five-unit first period play. And I've got Major League Baseball. We bounced right back in the win column on Sunday with the Tampa Bay Rays. Uh, they knocked off the Jays by a final score of 8-4. to four. And our baseball side's going back eight days now, 9-4 and four with our last 13. We've made a good deal of profits for those wagering just $100 per unit. Going back to late last season, uh, we're now on a 56-37 and 37 overall baseball run. So don't miss out again on Monday. All the plays available Monday morning, DocSports.com. Uh, the four-unit play in baseball, the five-unit first period play in the NHL, and most of all, that big six-unit play in the NBA. Only two games, but one of the sides is a six-unit play for us. Quick note from the first couple of days of the NBA postseason, you've seen nothing but unders. Eight games, eight unders through the first couple of days of the playoffs, and you know what that means. Public gets a hold of that. They start playing the under. Sharps come in play the over when the lines have been adjusted. The totals have been adjusted, and you know what happens then. Things begin to even out, and uh, that's probably going to be the situation over the next few days in the NBA. Uh, one of the totals from tonight happens to be a free pick that we're going to give you in just a moment, but uh, kind of keep track of that. Uh, tonight's games, there's only two on the docket tonight in the NBA, but you've already seen adjustments made on both totals. Uh, the early game is down a couple of points from where it was in game one, and the late game between the Clippers and the Warriors is down as much as three points in some books from where it was when it closed uh, for game one. So anyway, uh, but again, before we get to the free pick, don't don't miss what we got going on over at DocSports.com on Monday. 70% run with our last 27 NBA plays, and we got that big six-unit side going on Monday night. Let's get to the opinion, the free pick for Monday here, and we are going to play the over between the Clippers and the Warriors, total sitting right around 230 and a half. And uh, listen, it's down three points from where it closed in game one. The team's only scored a combined 225 in game one. Golden State did most of that, 121 to 104 final. But you look back at some of the totals during the course of the season. I mean, just over a week ago, regular season action, there was a 237 and a half posted total for these two teams when they matched up. There was one game this season on uh, in LA that had a total of over 240. Uh, so this total has been adjusted down quite a bit. Down again, a good two and a half to three points from where it closed in game one. And uh, we're going to recommend a play on the over. Listen, Clay Thompson didn't have a typical Clay Thompson playoff game last time out with the shot. I think he only made like five field goals, wasn't doing anything from uh, the deep perimeter from behind the three point line. We expect that to change in this one. And uh, we think that Golden State can drag the Clippers into a higher scoring game. And uh, so, again, our opinion, our free pick for Monday in the NBA playoffs over the total between the Clippers and the Warriors. And again, don't forget about our big card today, NHL five-unit first period play, Major League Baseball four-unit play. We look to go to 10-4 and four with our last 14 sides. NBA, again, 70% run with our last 27 plays, and we got our highest-rated plays so far in the playoffs, a six-unit play with one of Monday night's sides. So it's all available Monday morning, DocSports.com. All right, listen, if you like these videos, be sure to click on that Twitter key, even if you don't like them. And uh, be sure to subscribe. We appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer. Let's put Monday in the win column. I'll be right back here on Tuesday morning around 4 a.m. Eastern with our next report.